So I'm showing you guys Revolution Slider, and I'd like to uh, show you how uh, I kind of created this thing. It's real simple. Uh, you need to download the plugin from CodeCanyon.com, and there you can. Uh, it's a couple bucks, so I think it's like you know maybe 16 bucks, maybe less. I forget. Frankly, it's worth it because if you're building a site with something like that, you can definitely value from that. So. Um, how do you edit this thing? So you just go to your dashboard, click on the revolution slider, and once you get into there, you're going to see this. Well, no, you're not going to actually see that. Let me show you what you're going to see. You're going to see this. There it is. And you have two places here. You can either edit the slides directly or you can edit the slider itself. So if I hit this, um, I'll actually take you in. You can edit the entire slider. like width and responsiveness and like position and everything um, but once you're happy with that you're gonna obviously want to uh, make sure your slides look perfect so I'm hitting the edit slide this is actually a preview of what the slide looks like before it loads that's why it's just solid blue so I'm gonna hit edit slide again and here um, is where you edit the slide itself um, so let's say, for instance, I want to add a little more copy or a call to action or something down here. It's just click here to learn more. I don't know. Um, let me show you how to go ahead and do that. First, you're going to just hit Add Layer, and there's the text. You just literally drag and drop this stuff. You can move these all around any way you want. Um, but I don't love the way that this color looks. Well, first of all, let's just put in some copy. Click here. And I also want to see this fly in from the right. So um, let's go ahead and make the animation itself um, long from right or short from right, whatever. Um, you can play with that until you get it right. Let's get this right here. Let's, I want to get this smaller in black. So how do I do that? Um, well, first of all, you go style and you find a something that's close medium text. Now this is still not the way I want it, so how do I edit this? Um, you actually have to edit the CSS file. So if you hit edit CSS, you'll find um, actual CSS um, sheet. Now here you may need to know a little bit about CSS to mess with this thing, but for simple things like color, uh, it shouldn't be much trouble at all. So I'm just going to find um, medium text I can even do a find. There it is. Nope, that's not it. Medium text. And here I'm just going to change this to black. All right, update, and voila, it's black. Now um, you can see there's more settings down here. You can actually sh make, it, make it link to stuff. Um, you know, it's pretty powerful little, um, little plugin. So once you're happy with everything, you're just going to hit the update slide and let's go see it. Refreshing and then loading. Um, boom, boom, boom. And there it is. Bam. All right. I hope this helps. I recommend this quite a bit and um, enjoy.